very significantly. Um, obviously not been able to get on court at all for three months. I think we're past, actually way past three months, I'm past three months now, so it's probably like 13 weeks, um, which is the longest I've not played for um, since I started playing, which was in 1986. So a fair old time. Um, it's meant that just done a few token training sessions of home workouts and uh, a, f a few runs and stuff, but it's just, um, just needing needing a date to be able to focus on for me I wouldn't have liked to have like gone into full blown training since lockdown anyway, one I've not been able to just because I haven't had time um, everyone else has had loads of time on their hands by the sounds of it, I haven't uh, homeschooling the kids trying to work and trying to get through uh, get through the days yeah you don't have much time on your hands uh, with three kids, so um, that's been that's been tough, um, but fun, nice to be at home with them. But yeah, it definitely affected the training. I've not been able to um, to do much. So um, yeah, but that's as I say, that's not a bad thing. We we you know I won't be playing playing again still for probably another ten to twelve weeks anyway, by the sounds of it. So um, got plenty of time to to kick on and train. And if I'd started training, then I'd be. Um, I'll be Polex by now, so um, so yeah. I think um, obviously playing, but it's the competition. To be honest, I don't really miss. I don't miss being on court. I don't miss doing routines at all. If I'm honest, uh, I miss the competition. I miss the adrenaline rush of playing the tournament. I miss the. Uh, buzz you get about trying to beat an opponent um, and play matches that's that's the thing I miss um, and you can't replicate it unfortunately like that that sort of adrenaline buzz um, not been able to replicate that recently and I think that you know that can you need, you need that you need that I need that as a as an athlete so uh, definitely miss that miss that a lot I think everyone's obviously been affected a lot by these last few months. Um, as a professional athlete, probably none, none more so, you know, because training facilities gone, competitions gone, finance, money, income gone. Just, just literally everything's ripped out. So, yeah, I guess. As, when routine is key you say routine is key F for me it's not for me routine is not key um, I don't have a routine I don't do the same thing on the same day every week I do something different now uh, maybe because that maybe because I'm a bit older and I like to like to keep, keep it fresh and, and change it up but um, I'm sure maybe others have have a set routine that they, they do like week 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 so maybe that question isn't as relevant for me but I think adjusting your mindset to overcome a big big change like this is definitely something that is difficult talking to someone always helps if you've got um, problem not problems if you've got stuff you want to talk about um, stuff you want to discuss I think it's easier to share it and if there's um, if there's big, um, you know, a big change like like what's happened, an unprecedented change, then um, it helps to talk about that definitely. So um, just difficult, difficult for everyone, I think. Um, but we'll get through it. We will get through it. Spend more time with family, Def definitely one. Um, that's not always as enjoyable as it sounds, purely for the fact that for a long time of that, we were pretty much locked in the house for 23 hours a day. So um, that that's not easy. Fun for a little bit, for 
for a few hours and then um, tear your hair out for the others. But you can look back and laugh. Um, but no, it's been it's been good in general. It's just uh, just um, yeah. If, if you're able to um, go out and do a lot more, it would have been easier. But the weather has saved us somewhat. But it's very no. Just, to be honest, I mean, I'd I'd go out and play golf every day if I could. But I don't think I'd get away with that. So I haven't really had the opportunity to do that until the last few weeks. Um, I think an interesting question would have been. If I didn't have kids and I did have the time and opportunity, what would I have done? Which definitely would have been read more. I think we get too uh, too caught up now in vegetating, and I'm I'm definitely um, prone to that. Uh, not 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 necessarily not sitting and watching TV anymore. I think social media is one that I you know just can take over 